have you been trying to manifest the life that you wanted to live, that you've always want to live? Like, you know that your life right now is not what you are meant to be. Or maybe it's that you're unhappy with some of the things that are going on right now. You're unfulfilled. You're, you're, you're just not living up to your potential and you know that there's more to this thing than what you're right now experiencing. I want to take you on an 88 day journey. That might sound like a lot, but it's not okay. It's not a lot. You can change your entire life in less than 88 days, but you can cement it in through a very specific practice, a very specific way of doing this, a very specific pathway. And I want to take you on that path with me. Okay. Now you might say, well, why the heck would I even follow you? Because I've changed my life from what it was to what it is now through reprogramming my brain, through reprogramming my speech, through realigning my energy and my chakras to free myself from the matrix and from what the world has told me I'm supposed to be into what I know from my higher self, my eternal being, what I came here to this earth to do. My name is Dr. Lisa Brewer. I'm a doctor of metaphysics and divinity. I am the CEO and founder of Heart of Inspiration of Lightworker Academy. I have helped hundreds and thousands of people through various methods on social media, like YouTube and Facebook and TikTok and Instagram and even LinkedIn. And then through some online programs and coaching programs and all kinds of different things, retreats, but I've helped hundreds and hundreds and probably thousands at this point of people change their world one step at a time. So we're going to start at the very, very beginning and I'm sure you've heard the saying, right, that the first um, step in, in, in getting over something or, or addressing a problem is really understand that you have a problem, okay? So what I want you to do is I want you to just sit with me for just one moment, and I want you to look at your life right now. And I want you to look at it objectively, without judgment. Is it where you want it to be? Are you living the life that you feel very strongly that you're meant to live? Are, are you living the life that you believe you came here to live? Living a life of purpose, living a life of prosperity, living a life of abundance. Are you being held down or is there some things that are holding you back and obstacles due to your gender, or due to your the color of your skin, your race, your ethnicity, due to your sexuality, due to what you may have heard all of your life for all reasons why you yourself have been unable to achieve the greatness, the level of purpose, the prosperity, the abundance, right? That you know you are here to experience. Um, has life just seemed to hand you a whole bunch of really bad situations? Did you have a difficult childhood? Did you have a difficult teenage life, young adulthood? Okay, and so have I, all right? There's no way that I should be the successful entrepreneur, the successful healer, the successful transformational leader that I am right now. That's not what the world tells me. The world tells me that uh, I'm marginalized. The world tells me that there's I'm oppressed. The world tells me that because I haven't done certain things or because I, I don't live in a certain area or all of these different things that there's, you know, I'm a single parent, like all of these things, like they're saying, you, what, how, how do you achieve the success? And that's because I decided one day that I was no longer going to adhere to what the matrix said but that I was going to live the life of purpose and choose to reprogram myself, choose to reprogram my brain, choose to reset my reality of all the millions and millions and infinite different options I have in all of eternity, choose the life that I wish to live. 
and then begin to come become that and then begin to realize I already am that. So we're going to take you through those steps. But just for today, what I want you to do is this. I want you to take a sheet of paper out or you can, you know, go on your phone and put a note in. But I want you to write down if everything were equal, if you could live the life that you wish to live, what would that look like? Okay? Where would you be living? What would you be doing? Who would you be helping? And how? What, what would you be, what would you be driving? How would you dress? Right? Everything from start to finish. Would you have a house? Would you have a bunch of land? Would you have a high-rise condo somewhere? Right? What would you be doing? Who would your friends be? Who would it be the tribe of people that's around you? All of those things. I mean, down to the minute detail. Do you have dogs? Do you have cats? Do you have fish? Do you have reptiles maybe? I don't know. Do you have chickens in your backyard? I don't know. What does that ideal life look like for you? A life of ease? A life where abundance in every area flows? A life where you are living at a high vibration of love, of peace, of joy, of purpose. So I want you to write all that down, okay? Take that moment. When you write all that down, then I want you to begin to craft statements surrounding that, okay? And these statements aren't going to be your typical I am this, I am that statement. These statements are going to be thank you, Thank you, universe. Thank you, creator. Thank you, God. Thank you, Allah. Thank you, Buddha. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, whomever. Thank you, source, that for the last three months, I have had a million dollars in my bank account. Thank you, source, that for the last three months, I have been in a beautiful, wonderful, fulfilling, loving relationship with my life partner. Thank you, Source, that for the last three months I have lived in a three-bedroom, three-bathroom, two-car garage home with a studio and a den and a beautiful kitchen. Thank you, Universe, for the last three months that I've been in tip-top health with no issues. I want you to begin to thank the Universe for the last three months. This is my life. So. That's the man. That's what we're going to start with, right? We're going to start there. Now, in the next video, we're going to take that to the. We're going to start to do some shadow work, and figure out why we're out of alignment. But for now, I want you to write all of that down, okay? And then I want you to comment below. I got it. I want you to comment below. Thank you, universe. I want you to comment below and share with me and with the community so we can all support one another. Share with all of us what your life has been like for the last three months. My name is Dr. Lisa Brewer, and I want you to remember this. Give permission to your purpose to provide for your person. See you soon.